Hi, Assalamualaikum. Welcome back to Cikgu L Channel. Okay, guys, today I will cover chapter 10 from Form 2, KSSM Mathematics. Okay, which is about gradient or straight line. Before that, do you know what is gradient? Okay, now, look at these three examples I give you. Do you know what are the difference between these three examples that I give you? Okay, there's three... These three pictures shows the about the gradient. Now view this picture. Which area is steeper? Either A to B, B to C, C to D, D to E, or E to F. You can see, okay, and you can imagine how you climb up this mountain. Okay, how you climb up this mountain from A to B, B to C, C to D, D to E, and E to F. Okay, you can you can feel the, the, the difference between these areas. Eh? Okay, so gradient. Uh, what is gradient? Gradient is the degree of steepness. The greater the gradient, the greater the slope of the straight line. Okay. All right. Now, look at these three. Look at these three example I give you. These three diagram. Okay. You have uh, line PQ, line RS, and line TS. You can see here. The greater the gradient, the greater the slope of straight line. The higher the big angles. Okay. The higher the angles, the higher of the gradient of the straight line. Okay, now, I, I give you point A and point B and also point C. Now, do you know how to determine the gradient from A to B? The gradient of AB is the ratio between vertical distance and horizontal distance. Do you remember? What is vertical distance and horizontal distance? This one about the vertical distance and horizontal distance I have covered in chapter uh, coordinates. Okay, how to find the gradient of AB? It is, can be represented by M. Okay, M is for gradient. Okay, MAB equals to vertical distance over horizontal distance. Okay, so you get 4 over 3. Uh, how about to find the gradient of straight line on a Chatterson plane? The other formula to find gradient, you can use the formula of y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. Now, determine the gradient of AB. Given that the point A, coordinate A is 4, 5, and coordinate B is 11. Okay. You can represent coordinate A as x1, y1. Coordinate B as x2, y2. Okay. So, you use the formula, substitute the value y2 minus y1, which is 11 minus 5 over x2 minus x1, A minus 4. And you get 6 over 4. Don't forget to simplify the uh, fraction into simplest form. You get 3 over 2. That one is the gradient of straight line AB based on the coordinate on the Chatterson plane. Other than that formula, y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1, you have, one not, you have another one a formula which is negative y-intercept over x-intercept. Do you know what is y-intercept and what x-intercept? Okay. Y-intercept is where the straight line intersect at y exists. And whereas x-intercept is where the straight line intersect at, intersect at x exists. Okay. So, based on this example I gave you, y-intercept is a. And the value of x-intercept is 6. Okay, so just use this formula to find the gradient of AB. 
Okay, gradient of AB is negative. Okay, don't forget, negative. You have to add negative for the y-intercept. Negative 8 over 6. So then, then you have to simplify the fraction into negative 4 over 3. Now, the last part for this video is about the types of gradient. Okay, you will see you are the upward or straight line, downward straight line, vertical straight line, and horizontal straight line. These four straight line have different gradient. Okay. The value of gradient, okay, the positiveness or negative of gradient represent the directions of the straight line. Okay, you, if you have straight line that upwards from left to right, it have positive gradient, whereas downwards straight line from left, uh, from left to right have negative value of gradient. Okay. What about the vertical line? Vertical line, okay, that is parallel to y axis have infinity gradient, which is you do not know the value. We can we cannot identify the value. What is gradient for the horizontal straight line? Gradient for the horizontal straight line is equals to zero. So you can see based on this picture I give you the face. Okay, this face shows you the four types of gradient. We have positive value, negative value, zero, and undefined. Okay, so now. Do you know what is gradient? Gradient is what? Gradient is the degree of steepness of a straight line and can be identified by using three formulas which is the ratio between vertical distance over horizontal distance and also you can find the gradient by using formula y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 and another one formula is negative y intercept over x intercept so to further understand this about the gradient you have to do what you have to do exercise okay don't forget mathematics you have to do exercise practice practice and practice okay so see you in next video bye